One time I was coming back from work where you and I used to work, mm-hmm. and I was going to my apartment, and I see this guy and this girl having a really heated discussion. And I was like, oh, that's, uh, that sucks for them. And then I see he's got one of his hands holding her arm, and then he starts pointing <laughs> her face, and I'm going up my stairs. And I'm like halfway to my door, and I'm like, ah, oh, fuck. So I go back down, and I walk up, and I go, is there a problem here? You know, fucking white knight, I show up. And then the guy doesn't speak any English. And he's like trying to tell me something. And I'm like, yeah, I don't know what's going on, but I don't think you guys should be talking like this. And she's like, yeah, and she gets behind me. And I was like, oh, oh shit. God. It gets worse. It's way worse. <laughs> like he said Quanto a couple times. He said dinero and stuff like that. I go, he keeps saying dinero. And she goes to me, okay, fine. Yes, I have sex with people for money. And I was like, fuck. <laughs> what did I just walk in the middle of? Literally like, in the middle of. <laughs> then I'm like, okay. You guys sound like you just need to work this out. <laughs> okay, I go, ma- maybe you call a cop. And she goes, I'm going to come with you. Just take me somewhere in your car. I go, okay, that's, a, that's an idea that I'm not, <laughs> I'm not taking you anywhere in my car. I said, but you can come and you can use my phone if you need to call somebody, if you need to call specifically a cop. And she was like, I don't want to talk to any cops. And I'm like, okay. I'm getting <laughs> walking this way now, and I just walked away. And I, it's one of those situations where you want like a trap door to open, and you don't care what's under it. 